look at this video which has been generated from just a text prompt and tell me why shouldn't I think that the days of my channels are numbered or maybe it's a good thing I will go and do something useful instead of just sitting here making videos upon videos and just hassling you guys this matters movie gen has really rattled the industry in the last few hours since it has been released. You look at the quality of this video which has been just created with a text prompt. In this video I am going to introduce you to this project which was making some ripples around the research paper and stuff but this is the first time they have released some of the samples and stuff. The model is still not out yet. So I won't be able to install it and show it to you at the moment but as soon as it is out we will surely be trying it out provided I have the GPU because I think creating this quality of video from text prompt would require a multi GPU cluster but anyway we will cross that bridge when we come to it. So this model seems as you can see a simple outstanding achievement by Meta. Whether you are an aspiring filmmaker which uh, who wants to make some Hollywood or Bollywood or Lollywood great movies and or you just want to turn your existing images with simple text prompt into a video or you just want to uh, you just have written a plot of the movie and you want it to give to an AI model to convert it into this sort of graphics I think movie gen and in the future similar models are going to do it for you. So Meta is premiering um, this Meta movie gen which is a breakthrough AI model for media that includes modalities like image, video and audio. Yeah, This model shows that you can use simple text inputs to produce custom videos and sounds, edit existing videos and transform your personal image into a unique video. MovieGen outperforms similar models in the industry across these tasks when evaluated by humans. Let me show you a few more examples. So if I just scroll down here, look at this one. So the text prompt was a girl is running across a beach holding a kite. She is wearing jeans across a yellow t-shirt. The sun is shining down. Simple text prompt. And even you can just use another LLM to generate a whole text prompt for you for the video and then just give it to a model like this and it is going to create it. But look at these waves, the way these waves are kissing this sand. This is really amazing. Check this one out. How amazing this looks. So I believe what they have done is they have just provided this image at the top right and then with just this text prompt that um, this woman, you know, text input somebody is a woman is sitting on a grass of a pumpkin patch. She is wearing a scarf and holding a cup. So you see hands are pretty well formatted. Eyes are uh, pretty well formatted because these two things are always, you know, are a problem for the models. In addition, you see that when she smiles, there are dimples in her cheeks, which are quite visible. Very, very nice. And that it has taken it from the original photo. Let's check out another one. Look at this uh, thunder cracking loudly with all the, you know, audio and stuff. Let me play the audio too. Simple, crazy stuff. Look at this one again. So just a... Uh, so this is just a transformation. So this is what I was talking about editing the video. So on the left hand side is the original video with the balloon. And then we have asked it to convert it, sorry, a lantern on the left. And then we have converted it into a balloon on the right hand side. Crazy stuff. And there is a lot of other thing happening. For example, you see, uh, these are the videos which have been created from the text. Look at this one, tropical sunlight. Look at this one, simple crazy stuff happening here. So this work hasn't happened in a day as you can imagine. So this work is a part of a long proven track of Meta where they have come up with a lot of other stuff and other um, 
projects like make a scene 3d animation which you have already covered and of course the llama model so movie gen is their third wave combining all of the modalities from llama from make a scene from image audio and then they have enabled it by doing further fine graining control for the people who use the model in a way that's never been uh, possible ever before so if you look at some of the research paper and they have shared it so they have done the video generation so given a text prompt what they do is they leverage a joint model that has been optimized for both text to image and text to video creation and that model is a 30 billion param parameter transformer model that has the ability to generate videos of up to 16 seconds at a rate of 16 frames per second and these models can reason about object motion subject uh, object interactions and camera motion that they can learn plausible motions for a wide variety of concepts making them state-of-the-art models in every category you can also create personalized videos so th this model has also achieved uh, in preserving um, good quality in preserving human identity and motion which is quite interesting and then you can do the precise video editing for example in this one you can ask it that instead of boat just make it a salmon or something like that and it is going to do it so you can even do uh, you know um, some localized edits like adding removing or replacing elements and global changes like changing the background or style uh, and unlike traditional tools that require specialized skills or generative ones that lack precision this movie gen preserves the original content targeting only the relevant pixels look at this one so on the left there is the original video and with just a text input we have changed it <clears throat> look at this one how good is that this is a new frontier there you go look at this person there you go how and even the AI edited video on the right hand side is seems upscaled and enhanced so really look just adds such a good flair there even the human figures look so so real in the edited video there you go how good is that And this is what I was talking about that you can just personalize it. You can just keep it as is. You can just keep it in different settings. And I will drop the link to it in video description. How good is that? Amazing stuff. This is a new frontier, seriously. And as I said, uh, they have also trained a 13 billion parameter audio generation model that can take a video and optional text prompts and then from there it can um, simply generate a high quality and high fidelity audio up to 45 seconds including ambient sound sound effect and instrumental background music all synced to the video content they have also introduced an audio extension technique that can generate coherent audio um, for videos of arbitrary lengths overall achieving state of the art performance in audio quality video to audio alignment and text to audio alignment and these are the sound effects uh, let me maybe play it a bit so that you can hear Look at this one. Amazing stuff. I mean, uh, I'm actually, I know that I just uh, stopped speaking for a while because this is so mesmerizing. I was just caught into the moment I was just looking at this fireworks, which reminds me of New Year fireworks here in Sydney every year. Anyway, but look, um, let me know what do you think. Uh, I think this is simply 
astounding and this is the future really so share your thoughts in the comments if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and also towards and let me give a thanks to agent ql who are sponsoring this video and agent ql is a structured query language that turns any web page into a data source with its python sdk and live debugging tool you can scrape and interact with web content agent ql works on any page it is resilient it is reusable and it structures output according to the shape of your query and it uses the power of ai to analyze the page structure to find the data you are looking for and you will also find the link to their website in video's description that's it please subscribe to the channel and share it among your network thank you for watching